We play. We fight. We conquer. Hello, welcome back to the Freak Show. Or something like that. Uh, we're playing Battle Brothers, Warriors of the North DLC. The Northarians are riding again. We are going to Norheim. And it is there that we shall fight anything we meet. Probably. Mostly. Mostly anything, probably, that we might meet, sort of. Alright. Is there anything over here? There are. There's some stinky undead feet. I see the undead feet. Oh, what are you? Where are you going? Legionnaires and Veter Gangers? Oh, we gonna have a party. Let's go do this thing. I am all hopped up on soy. I'm not hopped up on soy. That's fine. I am going to spam weight, though. Speaking of spamming my weight, I have ordered things. And they haven't come in yet. And I'm very frustrated. Over a month ago, I've ordered a green screen has not shown up yet very annoyed uh my keyboard that i ordered should have been here on the third it is now the 10th and i know this is gonna be like on like september at some point when this actually airs uh, but yeah not not super great that it's taking so bloody long all right i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna step back one square hex whatever and that's going to be what I do. And hopefully it works out to where they can't get up and get their shield on and everything else is going to be fine. It would bloop, bloop. And it's... See, these guys are going to screw that up now. See, they purposely did this to screw me up. And I and I recognize it. I, I, I understand. I see them. But don't worry. We have ways. We have some curds and some... No, it's too easy. I know. I'm sorry. Low-hanging fruit and all that. Boop. Let's just shoot you. Ha! That's fine. And if you thought that was enough, well, we're going to do it again. Boop. Yeah. All right, I'm cool with that. That's good. That works for me. All right. Everybody move back one step. Get your booties to the back. Alright. And that's it. And now we just lob it out once again. Floomp. Floomp. Floompity floomp. Floomp, floomp, floomp. Floompity, floompity, floomp. Boop. Oh, he didn't get knocked away. Boo. I had my hopes. They were high. They were high. But the hopes were dashed against the jagged teeth of reality. And that's okay. I don't know why that's okay, but it's probably okay. You guys gonna, like, step to me at any point? You know, like, just, just roll out and attack with, with like, vengeance and hatred and... Oh, he, he didn't shield up. Well, that was an odd choice. Because now this is happening. Boo! <laughs> Nope, nothing happened. Just gonna stand here and look cool. That's kind of poopy. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I see, like, I see you guys are lining up here. And that looks real bad for our squad over here. We're not feeling the love all that much right here. But I got high hopes for us. I think it's gonna be fine. That didn't work. That makes me sad. Alright, so you are gonna give me your weapon. And that's it. And you're gonna smush them. And then you're gonna step up and you're gonna go crazy and smush them in the next turn. You are going to hopefully hit him at least one single solitary time, which you managed to do. And then we're gonna lay into this fool and do very little. Very little overall and be very disappointed in ourselves. Oh my goodness. Just not, just not working. Yep, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. We're gonna lob it out onto this guy over here. He's in a bad position. He's gonna pay for it. He did. Eh. Get out of here. Nope, did not work. 
All right, cool. Let's uh, try that again. Is it sad that they're more effective than the rest of the... You know what? It's, it's probably fine. Could you please... Nope. What about you? Who's hurt? This guy? Oh, I can't wait to see what these two do. Oh, a zombie showed up. Oh, cool. We're so excited. Uh... Ow. Ow. Cool. Glad your shields are up now. Makes everything so much easier. Well, it didn't really affect him at all, did it? Surprise! Can I hit you? Nope. What about you? Very, very small chance. Let's do it. Ooh, it worked. I like it. Now you guys can pull your not weapons out if you'd like. Good, good. Appreciate you. Get out of here. Uh, yep. I'm going for this, the the Roman zombie on the outskirts there. I'm missing a whole bunch of times. Right up into the mix. Not hitting it. 77% chance. Of course we missed. How, how did we miss that? We rolled a 98. Wow. That's, that's bad. But we landed the 55, so, you know, 6 of 1, right? Alright, we're going to take that, and I guess I'll slap you lightly. I was going to step up, but apparently they're keeping their back line safe still. Which I don't appreciate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zombie schmomby. Come on. Let's get the big boy in there. Ugh. Just crushing it each and every time. It's like one shot, one kill. He's killing it with that epic item. The malicious maul of the mauler or something. I don't remember. It was something cool like that. It was the malicious mallet of malcontent. Sounds really cool. I, I would totally use an item called that. Dude, I just chopped your face off. How are you standing again? Well, that guy's not. I guess it's all good. Hold this. Um, yeah, let's just chuck it out there. That's fine. Yep, I'm good with all of these things. Uh, sure. And that was all she wrote. Now it's just to focus on the stinky zombie boys. I feel like fighting that guy is kind of a waste. Just constantly. Just comes up, knocks him down, and keeps going. You know, you're getting beat up by that guy. That's kind of embarrassing. I'm just saying. Oh no, please don't punch me with your bony hand. Uh. Meh. Shut up. Meh. Ooh, that's a good hit. All right, archers, you have done your job. You can sit it out on the sidelines now. We do not need you to do any mo. Rush! My God, Foster, what are you doing, dude? Where have you been? You have not been this effective in a long time. Like he's just killing it right now. Okay. Well, he got two kills. KZ Freak got two kills. He's feeling pretty good. Five kills from Foster the Bear. 700 points of damage getting dropped on them enemy skelly boys. They did not stand a chance. It looks like a whole bunch of stuff for us to repair and make a little bit of cash monies off of, which I just left because we're full of inventory stuff. Ah. Lit what the heck is that? Besieged. This place is or has recently been besieged by the enemy. It's suffered damage, the supplies are low, and many have lost their lives. What is that? Ooh, what's additional fur padding? Let's see what this is. I don't even know what it is. Crafted from thick furs, this additional padding helps dampen the impact of any blow. Reduces damage ignoring armor by 33%. Interesting. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. That's probably pretty good. We got some more bone plating coming on in. I assume that's really good. I'm not 
positive, but it sounds like it's good, right? All right, let's go take a peek. So you're already set, you're already set. So whatever new amazing armor that we're going to get, we're going to want to put this stuff on it, huh? All right. I think the next time we get like a full plate of scale, so next time we get like one of his things, coat of plates, I'm sorry, uh, we're going to probably drop this on it. Which means that we have room to drop this and some other stuff. So probably something like on the coat of the, the decayed coat of plates. I'm not sure. I'm gonna wait though. Uh, let's see. I imagine prices are just ridiculous. Oh, well, the furs are super expensive. Um, yeah, we're we're not gonna get much out of this place. All right. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna repair up the things that we can repair. I'm going to hold on to the two-handed hammer, repair up these things. I think that one I don't need to repair. And that's it. We have so much just stuff. I need to get rid of some of this stuff. Alright, and then let's actually go back to the taxidermist. I think we can make... Okay, we can make some large quivers, and we can get some more tooth neck pieces. Apparently we can do a few of those. All right, so who needs quivers? Let's take a look. You have a large, you have a large, I think all of them do. You have a large and then you do as well. All right, uh, is there anything else that we can make off of the unhold hide? The heavy war dog armor. Regular war dog armor, different paints. I think I can hold on to this stuff. I think it's fine. I'm gonna hold on to it for now. All right, let's get back up to Skjold's Lord of Borg, and, and it's going to be fine. It's going to be great. Uh, well, I'm sorry that you were sieged. I did eventually come to your aid, I think. Not positive, but I feel like I did. Decent amount of money. It's nighttime because, of course, it is. Let's go ahead and camp. And we're going to wait as things tick by. Hopefully, good prices here. I think we will have good prices. All right, looking at the bloop. Looking at the, yeah, we're, we're good. Okay, let's get some, oh, okay, I bought what I wanted to buy. Thought I bought the wrong thing. I was like, oh no. Overpriced ammo, it's all good. That wasn't worth it, that wasn't, those are kind of worth it. Eh. You know, don't I have an archer that I specifically made to try to use throwing weapons? I feel like I did. Did I not do that? Was that all some sort of weird dream that I had? I think it was a weird dream that I had. Alright, that's fine. I think maybe it might have been my solo playthrough, and I know there was one on Twitch that I was trying to. Apparently, if you get throwing weapons with Duelist, it's supposed to be really, really, really devastating. So at some point, I'll try it. Again, I've always hated throwing weapons. Every single time I've tried using them, I just have hated it passionately. So I still think I'm going to dislike it a lot, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll give it some uh, some attempted awesomeness to, to flourish and shine here eventually. All right, so we're fine. We, we need more inventory space. Like, this is crazy. What do you got for us? Nothing. I'd, I'd actually be willing to try that. I might try to buy it. I might try it. Let's take a look at the weaponsmith first. I think I'm going to try to buy it. Uh, let's see what mission's available. Whole bunch of money. You'll pay me more. Good. Uh, travel to Norheim and Southwest and defend against the undead. That seems like a feasible option for us. Let's see what we can do here. I'm going to sell these brains. At least some of them. I don't. Still not sure what they're for. So a lot of that's going to be gone. Make our lives a little bit easier. You know, a lot of these neck pieces we could put out. 
Not gonna hold on to the throwing weapons anymore. We got some holy water, which is good. Whole bunch of shields. And the armors that we have are pretty heavy. 170. Let's get rid of that one. Mm. And it's going to give us a little bit of extra. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of this. Uh, 240, 230. These are 230s as well, right? All of these? Uh, I wonder which one's the least cool looking. Probably this one. Let's go to that. It's 250. I just, I'm very underwhelmed by that. Alright, I think we have enough whatever we need to survive. So I'm going to go and I'm going to pay for the overpriced coat of scales and we're gonna go and we're gonna plop this thing on someone I think we're gonna plop it on KZ I think KZ's gonna get it right away cuz KZ's working with what he's got right now and that's pretty good but hold on the coat of scales is lighter no it's sorry the same same 40 oh okay 42 I thought the decayed ones were heavier. They're not. They're actually legit straight up the same. That's interesting. See, I, I was under the impression. So really the only thing that makes these worse are the fact that it's like a lower amount of armor and durability. Interesting. I was actually unaware of that. Hmm. Do we have anyone who can actually utilize this right now? Alright, I think what we're going to do is this. We're going to go ahead and we're going to put this on you. We're going to try this weird fluffy armor thing, which I, I can't figure... There it is. Armor ignoring. I guess that's fine. It doesn't really look all that cool. I feel like the other one looked cooler than that did. It's fine. And then we're going to switch this over and give you the, the non-decayed version of the same thing. And then we still have that sitting around ready to go. And we'll put that back up on you. There we go. So whenever we decide to bring uh, Kalchar back into the mix, which is probably going to be relatively soon, we'll give somebody else a break. Uh, he's going to be set. Rikos is ready-ish, but again, he's got like the worst defense I've ever seen out of anyone in my entire life. Which is bad, but you never know. Uh, let's take a look. We'll give you one of these. Keep your resolve up a little bit higher. Get your resolve up a little bit higher as well. Just kind of resolve for everyone because you guys not doing so good on that front. All right. I guess it's time to take the mission and hope for the best. Get our booties on down to wherever we're going. Down to Norheim. We just whooped up on some undead, so if it's the same type of undead stuff, we should be okay. This is only going to last me two days, right? Barely. Barely two days. Alright. I'm here. What's going on? We are prepared for the oncoming the onslaught. Let's do this thing. Let's do it. I'm here. Let's go. No, we're not, we're not doing that. Come on. Come on. Let's dance. Look at me, I'm dancing. Da well, are these guys just chilling here too, ready to go? Come on, guys. <gasps> here they come, the undead horde. Oh, God. Okay, that's... All right, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, so I've, I've thought about this. I, I've considered this, this problem that we're about to face here. And my... My gut reaction, my knee-jerk reaction to how to deal with this is as follows. Get rid of our archers. Get rid of our back line as much as we can. And roll out with as many melee dudes as we've got. Now, should I drop him? He is the most heavily armored of our current people. He's got the salad helmet. He's got the basic mail shirt with the, the furry coat thing on his uh, back. I like... I feel like he's probably okay. I think I'm going to put him there. I, 
All right, Necro Savants, no joke. They are going to be a problem. We could roll out with the third company. There's a whole bunch of people here. I kind of want to do it on my own. Maybe it's my hubris talking. Maybe it's something that's going to go really, really wrong for me. I don't know. I'm thinking there's three to four of these dudes. I think I can handle... Oh, well, we're bringing people in anyway. So, I guess it doesn't matter. Oh, well, we're bringing the militia in, though. We're not bringing in... Uh... The special dudes, so I don't know how this is going to go. Well, that guy's sexy looking. Look at him. Look at him, he's dead sexy. Oh god, they're horrifying. Did you see them? Did you see them over there? They're so scary looking. Dudes, what are you guys doing? Guys, hold the lot. What are you, what are you? There's four? Oh no. Okay. Might be fine. Uh, oh, they are, they are so stupid. What are they doing? Guys, this is the time that you sit still. You hold the line. You don't step out. You don't get yourselves killed. This is not what you're supposed to do. Uh, well, there's one. And there's a possibility that they're going to come back as zombies, too. Remember that. This is the undead empire or whatever it is. I'll admit these guys look pretty cool. Those guys look far less cool. They are horrifying. But the skelly boys that were fighting, some of them look pretty sick. I like them. I don't I don't really understand the thought process behind what these dudes are doing. That's just that's just bad. That's just bad karma. What are you doing, dude? Nothing about what's happening right now feels good on our end. This might feel okay if we can actually land this. Didn't think we'd be able to, though. It's like, full disclosure, thought that was going to go about the way it did. Um, I think I'm going to go here. I'm going to try to step past this guy. Did not work. Wow, really? That dude actually hit me twice? You know the odds that that happens? Oh, that's such a small chance. And yet it happened. Okay, we're missing every single thing that we're throwing right now. That's bad. That's pretty bad. Okay. I'll take that. I'm going to borrow your weapon if I can. Thank you. I'm gonna buff it up. I'm gonna step in. Sup? I'll step up and say good day. That didn't really work the way I thought it was going to. That sort of want to be. Uh, I don't know. Like I want. I want to like back him up, but I just don't see it happening. You know. I think I'm going to stay back with you. Because I feel like they're going to send their boys up to do some damage. Oh, we hit them really hard. That was great. I'm going to have to wait. Alright, we're going for a big old swing right down the middle. And we hit them both. Nine lives. Kept that guy from dying. This is making them look real silly. Go for the, go for the militia. We don't care. We don't care about no militia. Go after it. Get him. Yeah. Alright, now I'm a bit concerned that he's going to get... Oh, he... No, well, we're fine. That's that's perfect. <sighs> Alright. We're not out of the woods yet. I need him to be dead. What do you... What do you, what, what, what do you think you're going to do, dude? Do you, do you know what this thing is? I'm not even sure what it is. He did. Okay, 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 it's fine. Ish. Uh, I'm gonna say that we're gonna move here. I don't, 
I don't like I don't know what they were thinking. Like why would why would they like I know we look cool and we're like this big old mercenary party, but like in what world did you think that was ever going to work for you? Like this is not good, man. That's excellent. All right. So we dealt with that. I mean, we're going to try to surround our dude here and, and see what's up, but you know, I got my I got my doubts that we're going to have enough to handle anything. Kind of incapable of getting to where I needed to get. Um, okay. Oh, I didn't mean to. Oh, I, I skipped his turn altogether. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to. This is a bit concerning. Oh. What are you going for? It's a good move smart all right I think I can oh that's unfortunate all right well I guess I'm just gonna lob it out on you You're just stepping away I hit F on this guy so I ended his uh, turn on accident which is never the idea that's never the goal he's doing well he's doing really well you're not doing so well. You did. The, you know what? I'll give you credit, buddy. For all of the people that really did stupid things, which you're definitely amongst one of them, uh, you somehow did the least terrible out of everybody else. Oh, that sucks so bad. Uh huh. Uh huh. Alright, well, I'm gonna try and crush you, and it looks like I can. Uh, I'm gonna step up here, defend our one archer with as much oomph as we can. He's dead. Oh my god! That guy was a superhero. Did you see him? Did you see him? That was amazing! Oh no, 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 oh, what? You didn't, you didn't want to bite me? Come on, man. I thought you had that. Oh, that's unfortunate. I'm a little worried that he's just over there by himself. Like, I I'm a little concerned. I mean, he's doing fine, but, you know. Dude, you're fighting your former fallen brethren. That doesn't bother you in some way? Like, that dude was just one of your buddies on the little, little militia, just living in the town trying to take care of his family. That dude's name was probably like uh, Jose or something, you know? Definitely not Jose, but it could have been Jose, and and now he's just zombie number three or ten or whatever the zombie number he is. Do I have a chance at hitting any of these guys better than the others? This guy. Nope. No such luck. Ah, I gotta bleed on ya. Bleed on ya. We just kind of have to sit in a giant circle and hope for the best. Oh, I don't like this. Wait. Oh, are we free? Oh, we are free. Oh, okay. Well, I'm sorry about your luck. Protect the archer! Protect the lone archer! That dude dead. Uh-oh. Don't be too spooked. Dude! Come on, man. Glasses on, buddy. Glasses on. What are you doing? All right, uh, probably fine. Okay, he's on, he's on the brink. <sighs> it's fine. It's also fine. Like, I, like, why am I having to deal with this guy? Why is this guy still here? Ow, that didn't feel good. 
Gonna wait with you, gonna wait with you, gonna wait with you, gonna move up with you, smack him once, return back to my position. Going to be very annoyed that I have to continue this. Um, he's tired now. And he goes, missed, missed again. And now we up with with our peeps. All right, Necro Savant survived. Because of course he did. He survived again because of course he did. Oh, you're 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 absolutely committed to fighting our boy. All right. It's like our archer. I mean, not able to really do much. Kind of has free reign to sit there and look silly. Alright, we're no longer defending the archer. The archer has lost the art of defense. We are coming forth to carry y'all home. That's what we're doing. Bleed. And he did. He did bleed. A little bit of the blue lung action. Go ahead. Go for it. Probably can't kill him. And you bled out. And we safe. Alright. I'm so glad that things have worked out the way they've worked out. That we actually were able to go in with extra melee units. And kind of throw off the entire Necro Savants thing. I'd like to have one more melee guy in reserve. But that was great. That worked out so well. Ooh, what's this? Shimmering Ashes. Okay. Sure we can do some stuff with that. That was fantastic. A victory, but at what cost? So many militiamen were killed in the battle. No citizen in the north wish to take their place. Hey, you know what? They should never have stepped up. I didn't ask for their help. Uh, we're not done yet, it looks like. Okay, what, what can we do with the weird uh, dust stuff that we got? Nothing? Okay. Well... Uh, I mean, we're, we're kind of brokeish. We definitely need a little bit of uh, of love here. All of these things are so. I'm just gonna sell them all. Kopesh. These sell for a decent amount. I'll repair those. All right, let's go ahead and do this. Oh, oop, that's all I wanted to do. What's this button? There we go. I guess our mission isn't done yet. Oh, there's more. You find one of the peasants carving lines into a stone wall. Seeing you, he explains himself. Just accounting for the lost. There's been so many, I can't keep their names in order, but I can count. Look down the length of the wall to see that it slowly traded names for numbers. We do what we can to remember, you know? You nod, and then, as if on cue, the watchman call out, announcing an another attack is on the way. The peasant grabs you by the arm with a pleading look. Tell me your name, and I'll put it up uh, for you in the, if the time comes. You yank your arm free and glare at the man, shrinking him down with a furious stare. I'm a killer, you fool, not your friend. The only thing separating my blade from your neck is who pays me. Wow. If you ask me that question again, I'll put your number on that wall and I'll do it for free. You got it? The man nods. You nod back and leave to prepare your mercenaries for battle. Another undead horde. Oh, this one's so much easier. Or at least different. Uh, you know what? It's probably still fine to not bring archers for this one. Uh, auxiliaries and legionaries, not notoriously easy to deal with with archers. They don't do much. I mean, sure, you can damage the armor and whatnot, but they just don't do much against them. So, ah, let's just leave our full minus one melee uh, squad members in there and see what happens. That's fine. And, in fact, you know what we're going to do? We're going to let Kara go in as the lone rogue archer. That way he can get a little bit of extra experience because all the others are in there more permanently. So, this will be a... Uh, potentially good for him, we'll say. 
yeah, but that's going to be a tale for another time, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys enjoyed our first battle. I think it's our first battle with Necro Savants. We, uh, we did well. We did pretty decently. And, yeah, it looks like the Northarians are kind of here to stay. They're doing quite good. There's not really a lot that's challenging their supremacy, which is always nice. All right, folks, until the very next episode, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show, and I will see you later. <laughs>